class photo controversy that a school is now saying is all a big misunderstanding. The Bridgewater Raynham Regional School District has apologized, saying that this was all part of a lesson about the Pilgrims. But the picture posted to social media is causing an uproar. WBZ's Beth Germano is live tonight in Bridgewater with the latest. Beth? Well, the school says that posted picture was completely taken out of context. The girl's parents say she actually volunteered to take part in that lesson. But the end result, some believe it just wasn't handled very well. It was meant to be an enrichment program for students here at the Bridgewater Mitchell Elementary School, a lesson in pilgrims attire. But this picture took off like wildfire on social media. An eight-year-old female black student seemingly enslaved by her classmates as an instructor looks on. It's become a lesson in appearances. I was stunned. I was horrified. Um, I was in shock that someone would post this on, on Facebook. I think. School officials say the instructor pictured with the children is the director of education at Plymouth Plantation, teaching students about life in the 17th century, when so-called lead strings were used to help children walk. But some parents at the school believe it could have been handled differently. It just seems like ens enslavement as, oh, you know, you of a person, not even like the color of the child has nothing to do with it. So I think that will ex explain exactly what we're, we're describing. Superintendent Derek Swenson would only issue a statement saying it was never the intent of the lesson to demean or degrade any one person or group. The Bridgewater Raynham Regional School District sincerely apologizes to the students, staff, and community at large for this unfortunate incident. Some parents agree it was taken out of context. I, I, I can't imagine that anybody meant any harm by this. I, don't, I just think that for the fact that the basic fact that someone wasn't thinking when they posted it is just, it's unacceptable. Now, that girl's parents met with administrators today, but so far haven't commented. Her father only telling me they are still trying to process it. A spokesperson for Plymouth Plantation apologizes as well, but says it's a lesson they've taken to many classrooms. Reporting live from Bridgewater, I'm Beth Germano, WBZ News.